my rank is a lieutenant colonel, carabinieri lieutenant colonel, and my name is Alessandro Criscitiello. And uh, my job here is a police, uh, it is police subject matter expert, police senior mentor, and a police senior advisor. Carabinieri, uh, we are uh, one of the four armed services in Italy, and we are the biggest one in terms of numbers. And uh, we have barracks in all over Italy because we are a police force with military status. We um, have jurisdiction over civilian and military within Italy and outside of Italy. And uh, so we're mainly a police force. Well, the Italian role in uh, African Lion 2021 is to participate with uh, uh, one uh, Carabinieri officer, that is me, and uh, as a contribution uh, with the memorandum of understanding between uh, uh, Italian DOD, in particular the Carabinieri, and uh, the US DOS. So um, the participation for my side, and so for the Carabinieri is, uh, is this one. Then we have also another uh, group of, an Italian group uh, of, uh, of military, but then those guys, they belong to the uh, Joint Operational HQ and to NDR, the Italian component of NRDC. Uh, African Lion um, strengthened the interoperability between partner nations because it's, at, uh, it's a, an occasion where we can uh, merge a component like uh, the Carabinieri or the police forces with military status within uh, an a such big operation and exercise as African Lion it is. Especially we're gonna bring our expertise for what is the uh, stability policing uh, subject. And that's something that, you know, when you are doing an exercise that it takes uh, or it involves uh, the phase two and phase three of an operation, then you have to think about the fourth phase of so stabilization. And that's the time when uh, stability policing comes, comes very important. Strategic readiness, uh, it is increased by African Lion in terms of uh, uh, just see the full spectrum of of the phases, especially the part that is regarding the stabilization, because yeah, we, we can we can uh, um, we can uh, uh, prepare a good campaign, but then at the end the campaign will have to finish, and all the c the combat phases will finish. So there is the need for someone that will take care of the stabilization, and the best unit that will take care of the stabilization phase and will bring. The, all the components to uh, the handover takeover with the civilian authority are the stability police units. And this is why I'm here, just to bring our perspective in the, this scenario in the, this, at this strategic level. Giving the chance to, it will strengthen our partner, giving the chance to work again together in, and also to, as we did in other, diff, many other different uh, mission. It's another occasion to work together and to improve the relationship and the interoperability. Definitely it is a very complex exercise and uh, what I will bring is how it's possible to uh, upon, relying on a really uh, deep organization how can it be possible to build up in really in a few days such a huge exercise, have it really well synchronized, and how this was possible, knowing all the, par all the partners, especially the Itali Italian partner and US partner very well, and so it is, um, it is really uh, a great, you know, it's something that we already have, because I mean, we are not partners in a few times, but we are very old partners. But this is again, a, a, another occasion to work together and strengthen uh, our ties. Since I was a kid, I always loved the Carabinieri. I always loved, you know, the blue uniform. And when it was time for me to do the military service, then I enlisted the Carabinieri, became an officer and, you know, served uh, uh, for almost three years in Iraq, two years in Afghanistan, and then now I'm at the co -Espo, so I'm using all my experience in, uh, that I that they gain in all the mission abroad for the Center of Excellence for Stability Police Units. I really would like to say that I'm really pleased and happy. This is my first time that I, uh, I participate to African Lion. I, I did with, uh, with, uh, with CIFA, with CITAF, sorry. And according to the, the MOU that there is between us, COESPO and CITAF, I participated to Justified Accord Series, United Accord, all the Accord Series. But this one is really, really impressive. It's the, I think it's the biggest exercise I ever, ever participated in my life. And so I'm, I'm really pleased and honored to, to have the chance to participate, you know, with the strong allies as 
versus US products.